All right, so um, I've never heard, to my knowledge, I've never heard of any of his songs. I could be wrong. Maybe he has one of those tracks where you listen, but you didn't know who who was uh, making the song. But anyway, Oliver Anthony, Rich Men North of Richmond. Mm, rich Men North of Richmond. I yep. love that. I love that title. Play on words. Right, let me just put the volume up. Well, that's why I was so low. Let's see what he got. I've been selling my soul, working all day, overtime hours. Bullshit pay so I can sit out here and waste my life away. Drag back home and drown my troubles away. It's a damn shame what the world's gotten to for people like me, people like you. Wish I could just wake up and it not be true, but it is. Oh, it is living in the new world with an home. Just miners on an island somewhere Lord, we got folks in the street Ain't got nothing to eat And the whole beast milk and welfare mm. God, if you're five foot three And you're 300 pounds Taxes ought not to pay For your bags of fudge drowns Young men are putting themselves Six feet in the ground Cause all this damn country does Is keep on kicking them down Lord, it's a damn shame what the world's gotten to for people like me, people like you. Wish I could just wake up and it not be true, but it is. you know but i know that you do because your dollar ain't shit and it's taxed to no hen calls the red men north of red men Selling my soul, working all day, overtime hours for bullshit pay. Mm. You can just feel his thoughts. Right. And he's the type of person that you want to like have a cup of coffee with and just have like a very deep conversation about the world, what's going on. And and connect with like he looks like someone that sees things for what it is and isn't fed up but like wants to wants to see something different in the world 
Yeah, my, my first reaction was like, whoa, he sounds really fucking good. Like, really good. And he just, yeah, he just has the voice that really, that can really strike a chord. And you really feel the emotion behind the lyrics. Yeah. And so I think everyone at some point in their lives, or if not some point, just repeatedly, we, we get the feeling of getting the short end of the stick when, when it comes to societal issues. And I think obviously with this song, it's, it's, it's the root of the song, like the societal issues and, you know, obviously unhappy with how things are being ran politically. And so, you know, I can obviously resonate with that. You know, and most people could resonate with that, you know, like slaving away and trying to work a lot of hours, trying to make an extra couple of dollars. And you realize like you're trading all your valuable time for a couple of dollars that is just it's, it's not enough. You know? <coughs> and I like his line, Lord, we got folks in the street and got nothing to eat. And the obese milk and welfare, you know, th this idea of like there, there's there's people that have nothing to eat. And then you have people that have so much to eat that they're overeating to the point where, you know, they're obese and they're getting those they're, they're getting, you know, the, the food from welfare. And so obviously there's a lot of perspective around welfare. And clearly it seems like his his opinion on it is that, you know, there are people just taking advantage of the system when there are people that actually really need it that don't get the help that they need because there are other people that are taking the help that they don't need. Yeah, and so when he says obese milking welfare, I don't think he is talking about obese in a literal sense. I think it's um, also figurative in a way. Yeah. But it's, 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 you can look at it both ways. Like some people like literally, not literally, but like they're milking welfare, like they're getting whatever they can. They're trying to beat the system, right? Like that's the game that, you know, a lot of people want to play. And it's, it's an understandable game to want to play like this idea of let's get whatever we can get from the government and to make our lives better. You know, I think where a lot of people have issues with that is, when there are people that take advantage of the system and that takes away from people that really need it, right? Because there's only so much you can give. Like there is a limit to how much you can give. And so when people, when there's a large group of people that are taking, that shouldn't be, that's obviously going to take away from the, from the pot that could be distri distributed to people that actually need it. Because not everyone who needs help gets help. And then there are a lot of people that don't need help that get help, right? And so... I think that's what he's alluding to. Yeah. Yeah, between his voice and his message, like, I don't, like, I couldn't have asked for a more, like, beautiful song, right? Because it, there's so much truth behind it. And it's also such a simple music video. He's in the woods, he's with his dogs. And you can just really hear, like, the pain behind his words. And I, I love the title of the song, you know, Richmond, North of Richmond. Like, he really thought about it when, when he wrote this song. <clears throat> and I love the way that his guitar looked. It was really cool. Very different. Yeah, and I think when you sound as good as he does, like, you don't need the filler. Like, you don't mm -mm. need... you don't. That music video, like, it, he kept it really simple because you didn't need to pay attention to anything other than the sound because that's how good the sound was. Like, I was really impressed. Yeah. And it, it's it's very rare when I hear a voice and it's like, whoa, you're, like, taken aback. Yeah. Like, there's only a handful of artists that I can think of off the top of my head that give me that that feeling of, like, wow. And and it's yeah. like Adele. Adele has that impact on me, too, where it's like you hear her voice, you're like, whoa. Yeah, it's not often that we hear artists in their actual sound anymore because there's just so much fil filter. No. Um, so yeah, this was really great. 
Yeah, that, I might have to add that to the playlist. That was that was good. And then, and then I see.